Thanks for watching D2 Wrench Works and DIY guys. Today's video, I'm gonna show you why you don't wanna just trash your Litman and get a Amazon one. That's pretty much your only option. But the major thing trying to get this apart is there's a bridge of wires in between here and that's what keeps it snapping back. So you really can't properly remove this rubber piece and just slide on a new set. So your best bet, and plus it's like 30 something dollars on Amazon, you have to pay for the return. The tubing is not going to be nearly as thick. If you see the ending of this, it is. I mean, this is some high quality silicone or whatever it's made of tubing by Littman. And this is why their cardiology series is super high dollar. And they know that this is a problem. This happens all the time on these Littmans. They break here. And it's generally because they get put in a curved area. And I guess it dries out the, the silicone here and they crack real bad. You can see it's all over. It's going all the way down the whole tube there. So, unfortunately, the only real thing you could do with the top part here is just salvage your earpieces. So when you get your warrantied one, you can go straight to Litman. It's like 150 bucks. This is what you're gonna get. Just this right out of the box and a pretty plain basic box. So you get to keep the, the new earpieces and you could save them for later. That's a good bonus. And you could just swap over your other ones. You probably already know how to do that. If you're here, it's very easy. Litman has these high quality little shoulder pieces and three ribs to actually hold them in place. The Amazon ones do not have this either. Just all around, the, the thickness of the tubing is also going to make it have horrible quality. So it's just something I wouldn't risk my money on. Uh, the Litman one, as I said, it is like $150. That's, that's a lot of money, but you can actually go on eBay and this is a one in, we wanted to get the same colors. This is like their plum color. And it was the only one up there, but there's other warranted ones up there for around $60, 60 to $70. I believe we paid 75 for this because of the color we wanted. So not a bad deal. The only thing you do have to do, since this is on there so good, this is such a large diameter and the ending inside of here, what we're gonna have to do is I have a heat gun. So what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get the, the tip of this really nice and hot, pop this old one off and then Hopefully it'll still be hot enough. I'm gonna try to get this on there nice and smooth. We'll see uh, But just wanted to show you guys how to do it and the one thing you should definitely avoid is do not use a knife You don't want to try to cut the old one off because if you gouge this aluminum inside of here on this diaphragm piece It's gonna mess up. It's gonna scratch and mark up the tubing and maybe even cut it. You don't want to do that So here's a time lapse. I have to take it all off Okay, so uh, when just be careful because this is actually all dry rotted there. So the heat, it was so dry rotted that when I applied the heat, I got a little bit too far away from the base here. I don't want to hurt the diaphragms. Uh, I believe we might have new ones. I'm not sure, but I wanted to try to leave them in there. So I didn't want to get the heat too directly close to it. And of course, when you do get down here, it's going to transfer. And I have a heat gun, not a hair dryer, so it's like crazy hot. If you let it get there, it could actually seriously burn up easy. So. Anyways, I got this soft enough. I got a nice little plastic piece that just slid right off. If you have good fingernails, which I don't, you probably could just pull it off. But yeah, just get it nice and soft and you could just see it just cut right through it and, and open it up. No worry about putting any damage on here because this is just plastic. So use something plastic or your fingernails or maybe a small little piece of wood to try to wedge it off. And now let's see how the new one looks. 
Actually, you could just press that one on, right on by hand. Yeah, look at that. Bingo, bingo, mm -hmm. nice and done. Went from all of this. Quite a mess. Looks awesome now. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good day. Please subscribe if you want to save some more money. Thanks. Bye.